Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are decorating the coffee bar. These little hand towels I got from the Target hotspot area and I thought this thing was so cute, especially now that we have a little one running around. This pop of red is really nice for this rustic coffee bar and I love also the softness that the fabric adds to this space. This canister I also got from Target. It was on Ben and My Wedding Registry and I love the chalk label that is uh, kind of built into the design. But I found that using real chalk as you're handling canisters can wipe off really easily. So I started using chalk markers on these labels. Um, and this one is a permanent one. I can just remove with alcohol when I need to remove it. Also, I love the, the color and with the blue and the red, it kind of has a vintage vibe. Having these canisters make it so easy to make coffee in the morning. The coffee uh, canister is nice just to pop off the lid and scoop out what you need. The sugar canister is nice too because if you want to take it to the table, you can do that. It's, it's easy just to kind of move around as you need and also to refill. I love decorating with a felt board, though my husband hates it. He thinks it looks too serious and like an announcement board. But I think the key to decorating successfully with a felt board is to keep it light with your sayings. Um, just because it looks so serious and stark, I think humor is perfect for this. It's kind of like an oxymoron. Um, it just kind of makes you smile or makes me smile. So I like to keep it light with the sayings. And then I also think uh, a good tip for decorating with a felt board is to have pretty elements that are paired with the felt board to kind of lighten it all up. So what I'm gonna be doing for my pretty elements for this is these really cute trees that I also got from the Dollar Hotspot area. I loved the snow that was already on the tree and then I already had these LED lights and I, the reason I love these LED lights is because um, they are where you can set them on a timer and that's really nice. It also has a remote that you can use to turn it on and off. It can also blink. It has a lot of different settings. And then the fact that it's um, powered by battery is really nifty for decorating projects like this where I don't want to plug it in and I can just kind of hide the little battery pack. So I put some slack in between my trees because of the way that it's going to sit. I have a shelf above the coffee bar and so it's all going to sit up there and so you'll you'll see how that comes together so yeah these turned out really cute it's so nice in the house especially at nighttime when you walk in the kitchen it's really really cozy so here's how it's all going to be and i'm just going to sort of get it all adjusted to sit just the way that i want it to Also, I want some lights to kind of come down for my little photo rod. I bought this beautiful little neat thing at Michael's. I thought it was great because you can just change it out for the seasons. I love to decorate seasonally. And then you can also, you know, have your photos on here. It's originally designed for Instax photo prints and I have uh, one of the photo printers and I love being able to use it for little family photos and sweet moments I can put up around the house. And I think a coffee bar should have three things. It should have a beautiful element, it should have a love element, such as family photos, and then thirdly, it should have some humor. I like that combination because I think it provides just a really neat place to start your day as you're making your coffee. You know, you're tired and you're just trying to rev yourself up for the day. And so if you think about those you love, you're also inspired by a beautiful environment. And then thirdly, you just have a little bit of humor to get you started off on the right side. Also nice to have some baked goodies here on the coffee bar, just kind of snack on. And then in here, I just wanted to organize things that we need for coffee and for tea because really this is a coffee and tea area. And I love these little organizing uh, tools from the Dollar Tree. This one works, this little basket works perfect for teas. The tea bags fit just perfectly and I like that you can kind of take it out and serve tea from that as well. 
so here it is it makes me so happy to come down and look at this in the morning and uh, just to be inspired by the beauty the humor and the the love that's on display here Thank you so much for joining me today in this video. I hope it was encouraging and inspiring. And if it was, please give me a thumbs up just to let me know that you enjoyed this video and videos like this. And then if you're not a subscriber, I would love to have you as a subscriber friend. I'll see you in my next video.